Hi there. This is a set of videos that I put together just for you. I look forward to reading your comments and receiving your suggestions on how to make these videos more enjoyable or ideas for specific content that you might have. Thanks for watching. Today, some very nice Porsches, including a 997 GT3, a newer Speedster, a 964 Turbo 3.6, and Cayman R, plus a Ferrari F355. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, an Alpine White 1986 944 with 69,000 miles sold for $8,420. A bargain sale price, this was a nice all around car with recent maintenance. A black 1987 928S4 with 122,000 miles sold for $32,000. I'm guessing that the potential bidders saw the mileage and failed to more thoroughly review the car as expressed in the photos. This was an exceptionally clean condition, and it was well purchased. A Guards Red 12,000 mile 2007 911 GT3, presented by a great seller, sold for $150,000. A top of market price on an exceptional car. This was well sold. I could do with replacing the excess red inside. To me, those just detract from an otherwise perfect presentation. A Grand Prix White 1990 911 C2 Coupe with 67,000 miles sold for $146,000. Another 911 in wonderful condition. This 964 was well sold. Look at those seats. A GT Silver 1100 mile 2019 911 Speedster sold for $355,000. A Canadian market example imported to the U.S. by the selling dealer, this car stickered for about $250,000. Some noted that prices are coming down to earth. This was very well sold. An Amethyst 1994 911 Turbo 3.6 with 21,000 miles sold for $401,000. Three months ago, it sold on here for $401,000. About that sale, I said it was well sold, and I maintain that belief, despite two transactions at the same inflated price. On the Ferrari side, a Rosso Corsa over black Euro 1999 Ferrari F355 GTS with 47,000 kilometers, located in the Netherlands, sold for $140,500. By comparison to other recent sales, the price is a low number. However, location plays a role, as does the fact that this is less than 25 years old and therefore not yet able to take advantage of antique car import rules. This was a fair sale. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you receive notice about tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On P Car Market, a Meteor Gray 42,000 mile Porsche Cayman R sold for $67,000. The sale price on this was fair, and I'll suggest that it soon will be seen as a bargain. I really like the R's. It tempts me nearly enough to step away from a 911 for my next purchase. I'll show more and talk about this 987 on today's short video. Two cars on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 2nd. A Polar Silver Tech Art Modified 1998 Porsche 911 S Coupe located in the Netherlands with 121,000 kilometers was bid to $90,000. A Delphi Green 1973 Porsche 911T Coupe was bid to $70,500. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a 72, a 2002, a 2022, and others. Stick around. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a Speed Yellow 17,000 mile 2002 Boxster sold for $24,000. This car sold on Bring a Trailer for $25,750 in 2019, and again earlier this year for $28,916. At the time of both previous sales, the car had approximately 5,000 miles. Today, the sale reflects 12,000 additional miles put on by the seller and the drop in value is appropriate. This was a fair sale. On cars and bids, a chalk over black 2022 Porsche Boxster Spider with 2,700 miles sold for $114,718. Sticker on this car was $114,490. This 718 was well sold, just like a new car. 
On peak hour market, a Grand Prix white over gray-green Euro 32,000 mile 1986 Porsche 911 Cabriolet M491 sold for $81,911. An uncommon combination. The gray-green seats have cloth centers, and then there's the wide-body rear end. This would have been better without the intakes and strakes. This was a bit higher than fair. It was well sold. A very attractive GT Silver over Truffle Brown 2020 911S Cabriolet with 29,000 miles sold for $115,000. With a sticker price of $148,000, this car has taken a huge hit, losing more than 20% of its value. This was a fair sale. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. A Guards Red, 32,000 mile, 1983 944, sold for $14,200. Equipped with Berber seating surfaces, this was an interesting car. The red floor mats, they just need to be thrown away. This was a fair sale. A Blue Over Black, 1972 911 T Targa, sold for $100,500. I like blue Porsches, and I like sports seats. This car has both, and I'm on the fence. Something doesn't seem to add up on this car, despite its restoration and rebuilding. This was well sold. Two cars on Bring a Trailer were a bid with their reserves not met today, January 3rd. A Chalk Over Black 2021 Porsche Spider 718 was bid to $108,000. A black, 15,000 mile, 2002 Porsche 911 Turbo Coupe was bid to $87,000. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a 2022 911 GTS, a couple of other 911s, and on the Italian side, a Dino. Yellow. Gallo. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a black 2022 911 GTS Coupe with 2,600 miles presented by a great seller sold for $166,500. With the sticker price of $162,000, this was the 992 that was well sold. An Alpine White, 23 years owned, 1989 944 with 108,000 miles, sold for $15,200. Included with this sale was an extra set of wheels and tires. This seems to have been a good buy, even though it is due for a belt service. A black 2000 911 coupe with 82,000 miles, sold for $30,000. This is a clean looking car, but it gives some of us onlookers yellow fever. This was well sold. A Meteor Gray over Sand Beige 2009 911S Cabriolet with 54,000 miles sold for $50,997. A nice car. Yellow fever. This was a fair sale. On the Italian side, a yellow 1972 Dino 246 GT with 79,000 miles presented by a great seller sold for $500,000. A beautiful car. This was at the top of fair pricing, edging into well sold. I'll show more and talk about this car and Dinos in today's short video. A single sided illuminated Ferrari dealer sign measuring approximately 64 by 16 inches sold for $7,600. It's a sign. Well sold. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you receive notice about tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. Three Porsches on Bring a Trailer were a bid with reserves not met today, January 4th. A Grand Prix white. 1991 Porsche 911 Turbo with 93,000 miles was bid to $120,000. A Guards Red 1988 Porsche 944 Turbo with 54,000 miles was bid to $28,250. A Midnight Blue over Marble Gray 1996 Porsche 911 Cabriolet with 70,000 miles was bid to $55,993. On cars and bids, a Ferrari 328 GTS with 49,000 miles was bid to $48,500. Maybe if they had taken off the roof panel. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. 
Today's cars include a Ruby Stone Porsche Carrera RS and a Ferrari 599 GTB. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a black 2001 911 coupe with 82,000 miles sold for $31,750. I like this look. Equipped with Aero Kit and Advanced Technic packages, this 996 was a fair purchase, nearly a bargain. I could do without the Arctic Silver console, though. Another black 996, this, a modified 2004 Turbo with 59,000 miles, sold for $61,500. Built to increase the performance of the stock turbo, this engine is said to produce 585 horsepower at the crank on premium fuel. This car also wears GT3 wheels in body color, an uncommon option. Similar to the previous car, I could forego the aluminum look trim pieces. Otherwise, for a modified 996, this was a fair sale. A guard's red 1987 944 turbo with 34,000 miles sold for $52,000. A great looking car, a good guards red and sports seats, and a top of market sale, well sold. A Cassis red 1988 911 coupe with 55,000 miles sold for $82,500. Not photographed in a way to best express Cassis red, this was a fair sale, even though the interior is a bit much. Speaking of being a bit much, a Ruby Stone red. 1992 911 Carrera RS Club Sport with 40,000 kilometers sold for $401,000. A striking car. One of 290 Club Sport examples, this car seems to have been a fair sale. I'll talk more about this and other RSs in today's short video. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On the Ferrari side, a blue 9,000 mile 2007 599 GTB Fiorano six speed conversion sold for $256,000. The factory produced only a couple dozen six speeds out of the 3,000 examples. The conversion cost on this at $40,000 easily added to the value of the unmodified car, perhaps a bit more. This was well sold on P car market, a Grand Prix white over mm, blue. 40,000 mile 1988 911 Turbo Cabriolet sold for $97,000. A nice car, only lacking sports seats to be better. The engine on this turbo needs a bit of work to rectify an oil leak. There's a spot on the roof and a crack on the dash. Still, I think this was well purchased. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, all Porsches, including a slant nose, a trio of 99s, a Turbo S. Fun, fun, fun. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, an Arena Red over Sea of Graphite Gray 1999 Boxster with 69,000 miles, presented by a great seller, sold for $18,000. A fair sale on a nice exterior color. The interior doesn't win any prizes from me, but overall, the car is attractive. An ocean blue over Savannah Beige 1999 911 Cabriolet with 83,000 miles sold for $20,750. A horribly photographed car. This color is beautiful, but nowhere in this listing can you see it, and out of more than 100 photos, only a couple have hints of blue. Despite the yellow interior, this was well purchased. Another 99, 911, this a triple black C4 Cabriolet with 74,000 miles sold for $22,000. Acquired here in 2020 for $20,500 and 3,000 miles ago, this 996 is in decent shape and it was well purchased. Another sea of gray interior, this in an Arctic silver 26,000 mile 2001 911 coupe sold for $35,000. This was fair to well purchased for 996 with a story. In 2018, the car was taken in for service and under advice of the shop, the IMS was rebuilt and the engine as well. $31,000 later, an engine bored out to 3.8 liters, producing about 330 horsepower and seemingly well done. A quartz gray metallic over black 1981 911 SC Targa with 34,000 miles sold for $39,500. This isn't a perfect car, but it does seem mostly solid. The wheels should be sold. They're 
BBS Mag Center so they have value and then they can be swapped out for another choice. This was a fair sale. A GT Silver over black, 48,000 mile, 2005 911 Turbo S Cabriolet sold for $67,000. A tremendous bargain. Turbo S production numbers total less than 1,000 cabs for both manual and automatic transmissions. I am envious. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. A Grand Prix White 1987 911 Turbo Coupe M505 slant nose with 18,000 miles sold for $265,000. I'm not a slant nose fan. This low mile 930 had a reserve price of about $200,000. It was well sold today. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you receive notice about tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On Cars and Bids, a lightly modified Guards Red 2001 911 with 136,000 miles sold for $20,250. Fab Speed exhaust and end cake system, shocks, painted wheels, not too many mods for a car with this mileage. This was a fair sale. On PCAR Market, a Sienna over black 1977 911S Targa with 187,000 miles sold for $31,911. Not a 100% car, but a worthy car because of the color combo and better than average condition. This was a fair sale. A Porsche 917 painting measuring 54 by 34 inches sold for $1,250. It's a piece of art. This was a fair sale. One car on Bring a Trailer was bid with its reserve not met today, January 6th. A Guards Red 1981 911SC Coupe with 91,000 miles was bid to $48,750. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a couple of mid engine cars and a 911. On the Ferrari side, a front engine V12 and a mid engine V8. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a white over black 1972 914 sold for $17,914. A decent car with a few rough spots, this was a fair sale. A black 2008 Cayman S with 51,000 miles sold for $30,500. This seems to have been a fair sale on an honestly presented car. A seal gray over Sand Beige 2006 911S Coupe with 53,000 miles sold for $48,750. I love 997s and the exterior color is great. The interior? Not for me. 997s are bringing more than I think is fair these days. This was well sold. On the Ferrari side, a Rosso Corsa over Nero 30,000 mile Euro 2001 360 Spider sold for $101,100. This car has higher mileage than most, and it also suffered an accident. Given this history, the car was a fair sale today. A Rosso Corsa over 10 550 Barchetta Pininfarina with 11,000 miles sold for $420,000. Number 366 of 448 produced, celebrating 70 years of design house Pininfarina. This seems to have been a fair sale. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. If you've enjoyed this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a 912 and a 993. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a slate gray 1967 912 Coupe project car sold for $45,912. A very attractive car. There is some rust. There is a need to rebuild or replace the engine, and the interior is red and black. And this was a pricey sale. A Glacier White 1997 911C4S with 61,000 miles sold for $156,000. These 993s are fabulous cars, and this one is impressive. I'm not a fan of wood trim pieces. Many like them. Beyond aesthetics, wood, aluminum, carbon fiber, not well suited to exceptional tactile car control. Leather works well. 
This 993 was sold about right, perhaps with a slight premium for Glacier White. No extra for Cashmere Beige. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. That is a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, a Porsche that sold, one that didn't, and a rare Ferrari. Hi there. On PCAR Market, an Arctic Silver 2006 Porsche 911 C4 with 60,000 miles sold for $32,000. Yesterday I commented that many 997s are selling for what I believe is too much money. This was a fair sale on a nice wide body 997. On Bring a Trailer, our Ferrari honorary selection is a Rosso Corsa and Nero 2011 599 GTO with 4,000 miles that sold for $690,000. Just 599 of these were manufactured, 125 cent to the U.S., 6 liter V12, 656 horsepower, and 459 pounds-feet of torque, 0 to 60 in the 3 second range. This was a fair sale, in line with previous 599 GTO sold. I'll show more and talk about the car in today's short video. One Porsche on Bring a Trailer was bid with its reserve not met today, January 9th. A uh, Guards Red Over Black 1982 911SC with 83,000 miles was bid to $41,000. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include Boxsters and 911s, while the Italian side is represented by a sign. And we have a bonus car today. Stick around. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, an Arctic Silver over Black 21,000 mile 2004 Porsche Boxster S sold for $24,250. Acquired on this platform in October for $27,500, this car has had eight owners. Eight. That drove the car an average of a little more than a thousand miles a year. Crazy. This was a fair sale on a nice car. A lightly modified Grand Prix white 1985 911 coupe with a couple hundred thousand miles from a great seller sold for $90,000. Carfax shows 197,000 miles on this car as of 2014, and the car looks great. This was on the high side of a fair sale. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. A single-sided, illuminated Porsche dealership sign measuring 12 feet in length sold for $8,888. Lucky. On the Italian side, a single-sided, illuminated Ferrari dealership sign measuring 30 by 50 inches sold for $6,100. Their signs. Well sold. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you receive notice about tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On Cars and Bids, a Speed Yellow over Black 2000 Porsche Boxster S with 100,000 miles sold for $10,800. A total bargain. This car needs a little touch-up paint and minor repairs to the top and seats. This was a very well-purchased 986. On P-Car Market, a lightly modified Silver over Black 1984 Porsche 911 Cabriolet with 86,000 miles sold for $33,250. A terrific purchase on an imperfect 911 cab. The few items that need work are manageable, and they can be addressed while regularly driving the car, if one can turn a wrench and occasionally cough up a little money. The dash is cracked, the seats are rough. Still, a very nice purchase. A 904 GTS painted enamel sign measuring 24 by 16 inches sold for $725. It's a sign. Well sold. A bonus car today, a red with white stripes. Does that give it away? 22,000 mile 2005 Ford GT sold for $295,555. This is relatively high mileage for a GT, but its price is roughly in line with others recently sold on Bring a Trailer. Two Porsches on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 10th. A white modified 1968 912 Coupe Four speed was bid to $36,000. This car has had some work done to it, and some of it's helpful and other aspects questionable. I think the bid was fair. A red over black with a 
10 top 1955-356 pre-A-1500 Speedster was bid to $260,000. Poor outdoor photography made this car look orange. Many commenters supported the color presentation as looking correct. I just don't agree. On P car market, a very nice Carrera White 2012 Porsche 911 GTS with 97,000 miles was bid to $67,997. These are uncommon. Only 311 six speed 997 GTSs came to North America. This bid was about the right price. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, a trio of GT3s, a couple of turbos, and more. 356 to 992. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, an Arctic Silver over Black 2003 Boxer with 89,000 miles sold for $16,200. Purchased on this platform in April of 2022 for $15,650. This was a nice car at a nice price. This was a fair sale. Another Arctic Silver car, this a 2004 911 GT3 with 70,000 miles, sold for $86,500. Purchased from a great seller last March for $90,000. It was a fair sale price given its mileage and a sprinkling of modifications. A lovely slate gray 1986 944 Turbo with 12,000 miles, presented by a great seller, sold for $81,000. An absolutely top of market price, this car was well presented and with 12,000 miles across three and a half decades, woefully underused. A similarly underused Guards Red 12,000 mile 2003 911 Turbo Coupe sold for $109,000. A nice Guards Red, 90% tainted by a yellow sea of despair. This 996 was well sold. If you're enjoying this content, Hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On Cars and Bids, a Lava Orange 2018 911 GT3 with 52,000 miles sold for $130,991. The sticker on this car was $161,000, and it was part of a car club renting out for $1,000 or more per day. This 991 is at a touch of work as well. A new rear bumper and repainted front end, but I think it looks great. This price is a touch higher than I expected. I would say driven by the lava, although as we know, color is so subjective and its correlation to price dynamic. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. On P car market, a Signal Red 1964 Porsche 356C 1600 sold for $50,000. This car has been on sale for a month, and a deal was finally made. It's not a great car. It's fine for a casual owner or driver. This was a fair sale. A horribly photographed marine blue over marine gray 1988 911 Targa with 54,000 miles sold for $80,000. Thousands of dollars were lost or saved because the photography made this car look a dull blackish color. It's a nice color combination when properly photographed, and it was fairly sold based on its presentation. A Guards Red 1983 911 SC with 155,000 miles sold for $45,500. Not a quality Guards Red, this car has had some reported refreshing completed over the past 20 years, but it's due for a overall refresh. It's another car that can be driven while these items are sequentially addressed. Enhancing the car all the while. This was a fair sale. A black 2022 911 GT3 Touring with 133 miles sold for $268,000. Sticker on the car was $188,000. This brand new car sold at about market price, but it's still way overpriced. This was well sold. A Porsche 991 launch sign measuring 50 by 12 inches was sold for $1,000. It's a sign. Well sold. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, three triple black Porsches, a Ferrari race car, and a Ferrari street car. But what more could you want? Hi there. 
In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a triple black 1991 944S2 Cabriolet with 99,000 miles sold for $13,777. This is a fantastic purchase price for this S2 cab. Very well purchased. Another triple black car, this a 14,000 mile 2004 911C4S Cabriolet sold for $52,000. Sold with the hardtop and the original, better, wheels. This was a high sale price for a 996C4S and justified based upon the condition. Look at those seats. This was a fair sale. Another triple black car. This, a 3600 mile 2012 911 Turbo Cabriolet sold for an eye-watering $235,000. Purchased by a gentleman that I previously referenced, the buyer of a Ford GT, a Ferrari F430, and a 4,600-mile 2011 911 Turbo S, this was very well sold. It is nearly a perfect car with a laundry list of options. Look at this. And while I thought that I would present this car in today's short video, it's just a new old stock car. Beautiful. Showroom condition. 3,000 miles. It's a dream, but to me, it should be a $100,000 dream. Don't get me wrong, I think it's a fantastic car, and I adore 997s, but it's just too much dough. That said, I'm very happy for the buyer and, and seller. A repainted white 1970 911T Targa project car sold for $41,911. Originally, a tangerine, this car has engine troubles, described as fuel leaking from the carb, starting and running issues, and paint chipping in several places. Yep, those are issues. Strip it and spray it in tangerine, and there's probably room for a small profit. This was probably well purchased. A pastel beige 1986.5 928S with 68,000 miles sold for $46,000. So many polarizing colors. This does nothing for me, but several comments remarked about the beautiful color. This 928 appears to have been in good repair, and the paint is solid, if not universally pleasing. This was a fair sale. A Baltic blue over beige 1990 911C4 Targa with 70,000 miles sold for $83,000. A clean, well documented car. This was a fair sale. For those keeping score at home, the reserve price was $75,000. A linen gray 1989 911 coupe with 95,000 miles presented by a great seller sold for $155,000. A beautiful car from all angles and in every way, this was a top of market sale price. I love it. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. On the Ferrari site, yesterday I missed a sale. A mostly blue Euro 1997 F355 Challenge sold for $105,000. One of 108 produced, this is a car that could potentially be registered for street use. It's due for service and other items need addressing, but still seems fair. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you receive notice about tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On PCAR Market, a lovely Atlas Gray over Stone Gray 2005 Boxster S with 55,000 miles sold for $24,750. This was a fair sale on a clean car. I'm not the biggest fan of Stone Gray, but it's so much more livable than all graphite. On the Ferrari side, a Rosso Corsa over Tan 21,000 mile 1987 328 GTS sold for $87,000. Unsold when recently bid to $95,000 on Bring a Trailer, I guess the seller decided it was deal time. This was a fair sale. Two cars failed to meet reserve pricing today on Cars and Bids. Today, January 12th, a Guards Reddish 2001 Porsche 911 with 40,000 miles was bid to $28,500. A Grigio Silverstone 2007 Ferrari 599 GTB 6-speed conversion with 1,300 miles was bid to $221,500. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a Targa, a pair of turbos sold, a pair of turbos unsold, and a Ferrari 
430 Scuderi. Manual. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, an Arctic Silver over a Sea of Grey 1999 Boxer with 55,000 miles sold for $10,100. Acquired on this platform in March of last year for $13,000, the photography and car presentation was much better in that sale. This may have been well purchased, but based solely on this showing, I would have passed. A black, modified, 2003 911 Turbo Project car sold for $44,000. This car was presented as being mechanically sound, but it is beset with numerous opportunities, mostly cosmetic, and the seller had a desire to be overly, extremely upfront about them. This was likely well purchased. A light yellow 1974 911 Coupe 3.0 liter sold for $63,000. Bid to $36,000 in a March 2020 sale, many repairs have been completed since that time. A reliable community member described the car as very capable, with just the paint lacking. This was a fair sale. A seal gray, supercharged, 2005 911 S Coupe with 40,000 miles sold for $60,000. Acquired on this platform in 2019 for $46,000, since that time an LN Engineering IMS retrofit kit and a Borla exhaust system have been installed as well as replacing the clutch flywheel and rear main seal. Said to produce about 500 horsepower. As long as the installation was sound, this should be a ripper. This may have been well purchased. A GT Silver over a very clean but angry graphite sea of gray 36,000 mile 2005 911 Turbo S Cabriolet sold for $69,000. This seems to have been a bargain price paid for this 996 very well purchased. The seller also just replaced the top at a cost of $6,000. Yow. A Carrera white metallic over a flaming bloody garnet red 17,000 mile 2015 911 Targa 4S sold for $118,000. Acquired on this platform in 2021 for $91,000, the addition of Sport Techno wheels added a lot to the attractiveness of this car. This was well sold. On the Ferrari side, a Rosso Scuderia 2008 430 Scuderia 6-speed conversion with 19,000 miles sold for $270,000. Perhaps a little light on the final price, I'll consider this to be a fair sale. And I like it. I'll show more and talk about this 430 in today's short video. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On PCAR Market, two Porsches, a GT Silver 35,000 mile 2004 911 40th Anniversary Edition was sold for $45,000. This car's condition was above average, and this was a fair sale price on a nice 996 Special Edition. A Grand Prix White 1983 911SC with 136,000 miles sold for $50,000. The interior is a melange of brown shades ranging from Burnt Umber to Van Dyke. None are favorites of mine. This was a fair sale, with the reserve removed once the car hit $48,500. An enamel Porsche crest measuring 12 by 15 inches sold for $850. A Porsche RSR painting measuring 53 by 34 inches sold for $2,700. Both of these pieces of art were fair sales. A single-sided illuminated roof dealer sign measuring 7 feet by 3 feet sold for $7,000. Okay, brace yourselves. I like this, or at least I like the look of it. This was... Well sold. Three cars on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 13th. A black 1986 Porsche 911 slant nose conversion was bid to $101,000. Yellow cashmere beige. A black Rest of World 1997 911 Turbo with 61,000 miles was bid to $145,000. 
A Grand Prix white 1979 928 with 80,000 miles was bid to $13,500. Lots of gremlins in place here. On cars and bids, a 2008 Porsche Cayman S with 110,000 miles was bid to $19,737. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a couple of Cayman, a turbo chassis, and a special guest car. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a Meteor Gray 37,000 mile 2007 Cayman S sold for $32,500. A clean car, this was a fair sale. Another Cayman S, this an Atlas Gray 8,000 mile 2006 sold for $46,000. Yellow sand beige. This is a fat sale price. Well sold. A repainted silver modified 1986 911 turbo chassis located in Canada sold for $51,000. A massive sale price for a chassis. This car was originally delivered to the U.S. in Prussian blue with cobalt cloth interior. Wild. Still very well sold. Our special guest car today is a white with blue stripes, 1800 mile 2005 Ford GT that sold for $405,000. This was in line with recent sales, a fair price. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Porsches today include a couple of targets and a 912. Ferraris include a 365 GT and an engine. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, an Arctic Silver over Black 2004 911 Targa with 80,000 miles located in Canada sold for $27,750. Targas are more uncommon than coupes or cabs. About 500 were produced in 2004. This was a fair sale. Another Targa, this a metallic blue 1972 911E Targa sold for $77,000. Only 861 E Targas were produced. A nice car with a nice sound of the engine. I think this was well purchased. A Viper Green 2.7 liter powered 1967 912 Coupe sold for $50,500. An unusual find. This is interesting. I think it was well sold. On the Ferrari side, a Silver 1968 365 GT sold for $156,365. The 33rd of 801 produced from 68 to 71. This is the largest Ferrari produced, and this V12 2 plus 2 was well purchased. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. A Ferrari F131 V8 display engine sold for $35,000. An engine manufactured for the 360 Modena. This engine lacks internals and is an artwork. This seems well sold. One car on Bring a Trailer was bid with its reserve not met today, January 15th. A blue 1974 Dino 308 GT4 was bid to $56,000. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a 968, a pair of 911 turbos, 996 and 997, and a pair of 911 cabs, 996 and 997. Hi there. In Porsche sales today, I'll bring a trailer, a black 2001 911 coupe with 87,000 miles sold for $21,250. A nicely sorted car. Not perfect, but it seems solid. This was well purchased. An ocean blue over Savannah Beige 2000 911 Cabriolet with 52,000 miles sold for $32,750. Yellow. As the seller noted, these 996s in this color combination sell anywhere from $28,000 to $42,000. This was a fair sale. Another blue cab, this a midnight blue over a sea of gray 22,000 mile 2008 911S Cabriolet sold for $56,000. A mostly Betty. Beautiful exterior, semi disappointing interior. This was a very well sold result. Another yellow in a well-sold result, a speed yellow 1993 
968 Club Sport with 68,000 kilometers sold for $57,000. These are fun cars, and this one brought a lot of money, especially for one not having the original magnesium wheels. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. A Seal Gray 2003 911 Turbo Coupe with 76,000 miles sold for $64,196. Equipped with aftermarket intake and exhaust and more, this was a nice car, well purchased. A paint to sample Horizon Blue 2008 911 Turbo Coupe with 56,000 miles sold for $98,000. Yellow. And another Betty. A fair price on an uncommon color. I really like these. Interestingly, a similarly colored car sold on Picar Market in November for $96,000. A Polar Silver 1996-911 C4S with 123,000 kilometers, located in Canada, sold for $105,000. Now that's an interior color. This was a good price on a good car. The location definitely impacted the price. This was well purchased. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On Picar Market, a slate gray, backdated 1980 Porsche 911 Steve McQueen tribute car sold for $124,250. An odd build. I'm not a fan, especially of the interior. It's 2,400 pounds and it has a 300 horsepower engine, so of course it's a performer. The components in the car and the assembly appear to be high quality work, except for the ridiculous seats. This was well purchased. Four cars on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 16th. A paint to sample Ruby Star 2022 911 GT3 with 1,700 miles was bid to $255,000. A Kingston Gray, backdated 1975 911 S Coupe 3.8 liter was bid to $257,000. A triple black 1988-911 Cabriolet with 170,000 miles was bid to $36,000. A Carrera White 7,000-mile 2018-911T was bid to $92,250. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include mostly topless cars. Spring is a couple of months away, and now's the time for a bargain. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a forest green over a sea of gray, 26,000 mile, one owner, 2003 Boxster S sold for $25,000. A nice low mile 986, this was a fair sale. A red over black 1960 356B Roadster track car, Sold for $82,000. Acquired on this platform for $58,000 in May 2019, to me, this car has a cobbled together appearance. $69,000 in repairs and maintenance were performed last year between May and August. It needs more work. This was well sold. A burgundy over black, 23 years owned, 1968 912 coupe, sold for $67,000. The seller has added 500 miles in 23 years. This is a decent car, well sold. A black over black 1987 911 Targa with 110,000 miles sold for $72,500. This is a very clean Targa, and it was fairly sold today. A guards red over, cashmere beige, 35,000 mile 1997 911 Cabriolet sold for $65,000. A good guards red, even with the partial yellow interior, this was a bargain price on a 993. Very well purchased. I'll show more and talk about this in today's short video. On the Ferrari side, a single-sided illuminated Ferrari sign sold for $10,000. It's a sign. Well sold. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button. And to ensure that you receive notice about tomorrow's show, Go ahead and subscribe. On Picar Market, an Arctic Silver over Boxster Red 1999 Boxster with 71,000 miles sold for $9,250.
a great buy on a good car, this 986 was well purchased. An 8 foot by 9 inch single sided illuminated Porsche sign sold for $9,000. It's a sign. Well sold. One car on Bring a Trailer was bid with its reserve not met today, January 17th. A black 1988 Porsche 928 S4 with 40,000 miles was bid to $52,500. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a GT3, a real engine, and an artwork engine. We also have a Ferrari 308, as well as an Italian and a French guest. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a modified 1982 911 SC engine sold for $37,000. The quality modifications performed last year on this carbureted, never installed 3.5 liter that pulled 329 horsepower on the dyno totaled more than $40,000. That was without the donor engine. This was well purchased. A blue and orange Porsche 928 V8 coffee table sold for $12,800. This is a ridiculous amount of money for this. I dislike it. I think the gulf colors are tacky and the intakes popping through the glass make it only marginal as a table. On the Ferrari side, a Rosso Corsa over beige, single family owned 1985 Ferrari 308 GTS Quattro Vivale with 33,000 miles sold for $131,000. An absolute nosebleed price for this 308. It is in excellent condition and it does validate the desire for provenance that new owners crave. This was very well sold. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On Cars and Bids, an Arctic Silver over Black 2008 Porsche 911 Targa 4S with 71,000 miles sold for $50,000. Sticker on this one new was $110,000, and today it was fairly sold. On P-Car Market, a Speed Yellow 1,000 mile 2004 Porsche 911 GT3 sold for $190,722. Sticker on this was $103,000. The sale price today is high, but likely fair. How many 1,000 mile 20 year old GT3s are there? And how many in Speed Yellow? I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. On Picar Market, an honorary mention sale, an Argento Nürburgring 12,000 mile 2000 360 Modena with an F1 transmission sold for $60,750. Remember the six speed conversions priced at $35,000 or $40,000? Excellent candidate here. A second honorary mention today goes to our French car, a black 500 mile 2010 Bugatti Veyron 16.4 that sold for $1,650,000. A W16 16 cylinder engine, 4,000 pounds, nearly 1,000 horsepower, and 0 to 60 in 2.5 seconds. Adequate. A reflective, single sided Ferrari museum sign from Marinello measuring 4 feet in length sold for $4,000. E un signale stradale, ben venduto. Two cars on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 18th. A 99% gorgeous Polar Silver 1994 Porsche 911 Turbo 3.6 with 46,000 miles was bid to $342,500. The frown has to be fixed on a one third of a million dollar car. The seller should have accepted this offer. A black 49,000 mile 1987 944 Turbo with 49,000 miles was bid to $19,500. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a Targa, a Carrera RS, and another 964 C4. Hi there. 
In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a black over black, 29 years owned, 1985 911 Targa with 96,000 miles sold for $43,500. A scruffy looking car with seemingly zero sale preparation, the wing at the back set a bad tone, but this may turn out to be a bargain. A tip for potential sellers? A vacuum. As is, this was on the high end of a fair sale. A Midnight Blue 1993 911 C4 Coupe with 129,000 miles sold for $78,964. A very attractive car. This is a fat sale price for one with numerous paint corrections, some obvious, and for a 964 with a need for an engine rebuild that will likely run more than $25,000. And then you'd still have a chassis with 130,000 miles on it and yellow interior. Well sold. On PCAR Market, a Maritime Blue 59,000 kilometer 1992 911 Carrera RS located in France sold for $235,000. Recall on Bring a Trailer a couple of days ago, we had this car, a Ruby Stone RS Club Sport that brought 401,000. It's one of 290 produced. Today's car is one of 1,900. This seems to have been a fair sale price on a beautiful 964. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. Two items on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 19th. A modified black 2011 Porsche Cayman race car was bid to $30,303. A 1973 Porsche 911T 2.4 liter MFI engine was bid to $8,500. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a GT4, a couple of turbos, one a Turbo S. All told, a handful of 911s and a couple of Cayman and a Boxster. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a Midnight Blue 2007 911 Coupe with 84,000 miles sold for $43,000. This car has an accident in its past and I would call the sale well sold. But it's really about market price these days. I've previously remarked about high prices for 997s. This was too much. This should be a mid-30s car, especially with the two-tone seas of gray interior. A GT Silver over bloody Boxster Red 48,000 mile 2005 911 Turbo S Cabriolet sold for $93,000. In September 2021, this 996 sold on this same platform for $93,000. Now, just 600 miles later, samesies. This was a fair sale. A lightly modified Guards Red 24,000 mile 2001 911 Turbo Coupe sold for $81,000. Yellow. This sale price was fair, but the seller should have mounted the original wheels before photography. Another lightly modified red 911, this a Bahia Red 2.7 liter powered 1970 911T sold for $43,000. Potentially a bargain, but with some questions. Clearly a driver with some upgrades along the way, this seller states that the upgraded 230 horsepower engine, rebuilt nearly 20 years ago and 25,000 miles ago, does not leak, and hasn't in that time period. Amazing. Current performance is 0 to 60 and 4.9. That is a fast T. A Grand Prix White 1989 911 Coupe with 79,000 miles, presented by a great seller, sold for $78,500. A very nice car. This seems to have been a fair sale. A racing yellow 2020 Cayman GT4 with 3,000 miles sold for $125,718. Perhaps just a tad on the rich side, this is an attractive car that has had the suspension lowered and tweaked with new control arms and tow links. It must fly. Yellow. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. An illuminated, single-sided Porsche dealership sign measuring roughly 15 feet long and a foot high sold for $15,000. It's a sign. Well sold. 
On PCAR market, a Guards Red over Coco 2005 Porsche Boxster with 65,000 miles sold for $19,000. A nice car, this 987 was a fair sale. A Porsche 962 racing car painting measuring 54 by 24 inches was sold for $600. This artwork was a fair sale. Two Porsches on Bring a Trailer were bid with reserves not met today, January 20th. An Agate Gray 2022 911 GTS Coupe with 387 miles was bid to $159,001. A modified Grand Prix whitish RSR style 1980 930 Turbo was bid to $100,000. That's a shame. Purchased last March on this platform for $165,000. Yikes. About this car, I commented that the exhaust and tune allowed for, quote, roasting weenies out back. On cars and bids, a Meteor Gray 2007 Cayman with 65,000 miles was bid to $19,250. It's noted on CNB that a sale was executed post auction. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, all Porsche 911s, all in silver. Later, a new feature a glance at upcoming sales, live auctions. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a 1969 911E 2.0-liter engine sold for $16,000. Seemingly a fair sale, the seller did much to enhance the sale with great communication. An Arctic Silver over Blue 22,000 mile 1999 911 Cabriolet sold for $34,996. An early 996 build, this is subject to that micro market, and the favorable mileage and color combination pushed this higher than a casual observer might anticipate. This was a fair sale. A Polar Silver 1996 911 Coupe with 59,000 miles sold for $87,000. Perhaps a tad lower than expected, the Black Stone Guards did no favors to the seller. This was a fair sale on a decent 993. Another Polar Silver over Black 993, this a 1996 Turbo with 58,000 miles sold for $200,000. A nicely presented, mostly high quality car, this was a fair sale given that it has had paintwork in multiple areas. A GT Silver 2022 911 GT3 Touring with 5,900 miles sold for $223,000. Sticker on this 992 was $168,000. So perhaps a nice profit was made after actually putting miles on the car. This was a well sold market sale, meaning it's overpriced to me, but it's close to general market prices, if you can find one that you like. I'll show more and talk about this car in today's short video. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. One car on Bring a Trailer was bid with its reserve not met today, January 21st. An Aussie Blue 1969 912 Coupe 4 speed was bid to $44,924. And now for the new feature, perusing active Bring a Trailer sales closing in the near future. Here's a peek at the few that happen to catch my eye. Closing in two days, a black 968 with 75,000 miles and the M030 Sport Package, currently at just over $17,000. Ending in three days, a black 98 911S with 73,000 miles from a great seller, currently at $92,000. Ending in three days, a white with red 2004 911 GT3 RS with 39,000 miles is currently bid to $180,000. Closing in six days is a triple black 9,000 mile 1994 911 Speedster, currently bid to $80,000. Closing in 10 days, a Grand Prix white 1991 911 C4 like bow, currently bid to $200,100. This is an amazing 73 kilometer car slash museum piece. Ending in 11 days, a 1990 911C2 by Singer is currently bid to $876,000. Concluding in six days, a 2002 Ferrari 360 Spider, current bid is $71,777. On PCAR market, ending in two days, a black 1997 
Porsche 911 Turbo, modified by roof with 70,000 miles, has a current bid of $180,000. Let me know what you think about this feature. I'm curious. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. Today, Porsches include a 928, a 911 Turbo, and a project car. On the Italian side, a Dino, a 308, and a sign. Hi there. In Porsche sales today on Bring a Trailer, a Grand Prix White 1984 928S with 66,000 miles sold for $23,750. Offered on this platform in June of last year with a high bid of $22,928, this was a fair sale. Poor photography central on this listing, but take a gander at the interior. If you can handle that, this was a decent car. A slate gray modified 2004 911 Turbo Coupe with 82,000 miles sold for $58,000. I've spoken about my affinity for 996 and 997 Turbos, and I think that they represent great value. And this is a bargain. The modifications of this car were appropriate and I think actually enhanced value. However, I think most bidders probably took a couple of dollars off because it has been modified. Requiring modifications. A rusty tangerine-ish 1969 911T Targa project car sold for $8,600. Truly, bring a trailer and a dustpan. This was quite an auction. 274 comments on the car and it sold for eight and a half grand. Many parts are missing. It is a $150,000 to $200,000 car when properly assembled. It might take more than that to get there. This was well sold. If you're enjoying this content, hit that like button, and to ensure that you don't miss tomorrow's show, go ahead and subscribe. On the Italian side, a silver 26 years owned 1977 Ferrari 308 GTB with 129,000 miles sold for $69,308. Listed and closed at $64,000 last November, the high bidder did not complete the transaction. The seller has driven this car 108,000 miles. Fascinating. I, I love that it's been driven. Still, this seems to be a fair sale. A fly yellow 1971 Dino 246 GT with 45,000 miles sold for $425,000. I covered a similar 1972 Dino a couple of weeks ago that brought 500,000. Today's sale seems slightly on the well-purchased side. I'll compare these Italian Gallos in today's short video. An illuminated, single-sided Ferrari and Marlboro sign measuring 78 by 39 inches sold for $15,500. It's a sign. Well sold. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well.